that every day the president and his family, because they are the ones staying in the state house, they spend 1.1 billion. They spend 47.7 million per hour and uh, 795,000 per minute. To put it even more clearly, for every two minutes, you can count now, every two minutes, they are spending 1.5 million, every two minutes. This parliament will be in breach of the constitution if it passes a budget that allows the president to illegally swim in a luxury at the expense of the citizens' welfare. The, president, the Presidential Emoluments and Benefits Act 1998 provides the salary, allowances, and benefits to the president. When budgeting for the president and his family, this law applies. Unfortunately, the previous from... Uganda's Yori Museveni has hit the headlines again after his expenditure was posted public. The president spends more than 350 million on the things which will shock you and 300 plus billion on materialistic things. How is he spending all that cash? Please let me explain. Welcome back to Teens Republic, the life to life educative channel. Before we continue please subscribe to this channel. We promise you will have the best videos for you to watch and learn. In the Ugandan financial year 2023-2024, the annual budget estimates proposed to have 350 million shillings set aside for President Yori Museveni's beddings, clothes and footwear. In the budget estimates, Ugandan 239 billion had been allocated to state house as the opposition proposed this amount be reduced to 82 billion. Despite the fact that the same amount was granted in the prior fiscal year, opposition leaders are opposed to these suggestions. Others bemoan the urgent need for infrastructure improvements, like as the notorious pothole-filled roads in Kampala, while some said that the president was not a Hollywood star to have such money spent on his clothes. Ugandan 43 billion was also proposed for ceremonies, 600 million for furnishing state house and SH 184 million for veterinary services among other items. I mean wow. According to Ms. Semuju. Madam Speaker, <clears throat> the law provides for one residence state house. The president operates two residences. Go back to the law on presidential Emoluments and Benefits Act. It provides for one residence to the president. Where, where, where which residences are those? Uh, you have told me to read the report. Can I read the madam? <laughs> the president operates two residences at Nakasero and Entebbe illegally. That's why his electricity bill at 500 million and water bill at 500 million per year is bigger than a big factory like roofings. Whatever they are manufacturing at State House, Allah knows. Honorable members, I would like to draw your attention to other items to be funded under State House. There is 550 million shillings to buy clothes. The same amount was provided Can last you? year. He's this means the we are spending He's on average. Reading. I am reading the He's report. reading the report. Honorable Minister, sit down. The same amount was provided last year. This means we are spending on average one million shilling on President Cross on President President Museveni's clothes every day. Our president is not a star from Hollywood, requiring to change wardrobe every day. He's the president of a poor country. Why buy him clothes worth 350 million every year? What happened to the clothes that we bought last year? We are providing 600 million shilling for furniture. We provided the same amount last year. This residence <coughs> has one. Honorable members, you will have, have time to debate that report. We are providing 600 million shillings for furniture. The same amount was provided last year. This residence has won itself a place in the history of Uganda. The beds in the public health facilities are not there. But the president is buying clothes and furniture every year. We are providing 7.8 billion for agriculture supplies. We are also providing another 184 billion for veterinary services. Did the president turn the state house into a farm without the knowledge of the country? Parliament must be sure that we are not, pro we are not the ones providing funding for President Museveni's private farms in Chisos and Rwakitura. 
to make matters worse, he has provided himself with 120 billion shillings for classified expenditure at his residence. That we have spoken about earlier, I can skip. The president has a duty not to abuse the state house, but if he chooses to do so, this parliament is an obligation to stop him. President According to the Parliament of Uganda, the government revised the 2023-2024 financial year budget to 52 trillion from 51 trillion as part of correcting errors and omissions under the draft budget estimates that were tabled by the Minister of Finance on March 30, 2023 due to his political stature and a 37-year presidency. Mr Museveni is thought to be worth tens of millions of dollars outside of his function as President of Uganda. The precise sum is still a mystery. Thank you for watching this interesting video, let me know what you have in mind in the comment section below. If you learned something, like this video and subscribe so that you can't miss videos like this in the future. Also, don't forget to watch these other videos, I'm sure you will like them. And remember successful people look like you because you're ready to learn. Thank you. Subscribe.